Hi Earth Signs, welcome Taurus, Cappy and Virgo to my channel. This is going to be a weekly read for you. We're going to suss out the energies for you this upcoming week. Um, now it is centered around Earth Signs, but of course if you're dealing with an Earth Sign, um, this is going to be helpful for you as well. So um, some weekly predictions um, using this medieval deck that I have here. So we'll see what comes up for you. I'm excited to bring you some news um earth signs so let's have a look and see taurus cabby virgo what is coming up around you this week ahead Okay, walking a bit of a tight tight rope I'm getting. Okay, there's news or communication that's coming in for you. Okay, I'm getting an offer and counter offers. I'm getting a lot of back and forth in a situation this week. So a lot of things going to and from. There's a lot of back and forth and indecisiveness um, that's going on here. Okay. I'm getting that some of you sort of feel trapped. Um, trapped in a situation. Okay, interestingly, you have come up as the Knight of Cups reversed. Um, what are signs? So this is strong Pisces energy, as you can sort of see with the fish scales here. Um, but it's reversed, so Pisces energy reversed. You know, I feel like there is some sort of emotional detachment that may be happening. Um, I feel like what's governing your reading is that Ace of Pentacles, but it's reversed. So some of you are like, you're feeling like you're slowly losing control of a situation or losing touch with a person maybe. It's almost like some distancing or some emotional detachments happening from your side. Um, possibly theirs as well. It could be a uh, fire sign. We've got a fire queen here, so it could be with an Aries, Sag or Leo. Um, I feel like at this stage, I'm seeing you sort of opening yourself up to nothing too heavy. So I feel like this week, you're sort of just keeping things light, keeping things... Um, keeping things easy going i feel like there is an upcoming attraction here could be a new attraction a new lover a new person coming in but i definitely feel like there is some um i feel like you're trying to detach from a person you're crazy about or for a person like you're super attracted to or it's like they're coming forward with an offer saying you know i want to date you i'm interested but you're just like no 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 maybe i'm not ready like for anything heavy duty i don't want anything emotional i just want good times um, so there could be someone who's sort of wanting more from you, but I feel like your energy water signs is much more like reserved, is much more to yourself. Um, ace of, ace of pentacles. Some of you might not be ready to settle down. You might not be ready for anything long-term or for the long haul because you're just, you're just not in that energy maybe. Um, the page of swords is here and he's very curious. So... I see some of you entering into maybe like a friends with benefits situation, maybe. Um, it could be with an air sign or it could be, like I said, with this fire sign. Four of Wands, there is a relationship here, but you don't want it. I'm seeing that you're not completely invested in what someone is wanting to offer you. Um, I don't know if you're waiting out for a particular connection or a particular person, but I feel like with this card here, I feel like you are waiting for something better or you're waiting for someone in particular, maybe. So, yeah, there may be a bit of a waiting game um, happening here, I think, for some of you this week. To be honest, I feel like it's, you know, you don't really want the drama you don't really want a situation. You don't... I feel like you've been through a lot recently and you just don't want that again. You're not ready to go through that again. So I feel like that's... Um, I feel like that's what's coming up. I also feel like, I mean, this could be not necessarily an offer of love. It could be another opportunity in your life which you aren't taking because you're not emotionally there. You're not emotionally invested or your heart's telling you like, 
deep down, you know, maybe you have a new living situation or an offer to have a different job or an offer to be with another person. But deep down, it's not what your heart is telling you to do. So, you know, as a result, you're like, well, I'm not going to do that because it makes me feel a certain type of way. It makes me feel this way. So yeah, I just, I, I feel like you're wanting something different. You're wanting something more. And I think you're not going after something until it's perfect, um, until it's exactly what you want. I feel like you don't want to hurt anymore. Ten of Swords, you're like rejecting that pain. Maybe you're still going through a betrayal for some of you. I feel like there may be a connection or a relationship, but it's just not the right time for some reason. I think healing needs to happen still, or you know, you've just got you've just got other things on your mind. Um, yeah. I think there's other distractions that are making you not as ready as you think you are or as you want to be um, towards a situation or towards a person. I see you taking some action, but it seems to be more lust related than anything. I think it seems more, yeah, more attraction. It is Leo energy, the Queen of Wands here. So um, there could be a fire sign Leo. I feel like this person might be very forward with you, um, especially like sexually. They could be fairly like, they could make a move on you fairly quickly. You know, they just want to jump on top of you. They can't keep their hands off you. You know, it's more like that. But emotionally, you're not in the right space for some reason. And I think that's sort of holding holding things back um, a little bit more uh, is what I'm seeing. I'm getting like not ready. So you know, potentially could be not ready for something like a part of you wants it, but then another part, a bigger part is like holding you back or preventing you from moving forward or taking any action. Um, okay. I feel like with the four of ones here, there could be some sort of truce um, or some sort of compromising situation. It's like a something's going to pop up for you this week and it's going to be an opportunity for you to show how much you can compromise. Um, it also could be that someone wants to compromise with you. So, you know, they're trying to be level-headed about something here. Uh, they want you to compromise with them. So sacrifices need to be made um, in this situation, but I want to do it together. So, uh, I mean, this is someone that's willing to work. I really get that someone is, is is wanting to give you a lot here, water signs. I'm just, I'm not getting that you want to accept it. Or that you want to give them, um, that you want to give them all these things. Yeah, like I feel, I just feel like you are, it's a little bit all over the place like I'm kind of like struggling with this reading to be honest I feel like you are all over the place in terms of thoughts and actions like you're doing one thing but yet you want to do another so I feel like maybe take it easy this week don't make any solid decisions because I don't think you're going to stick to them anyway um you're not emotionally invested in the situation there's a reason why um and that's okay you know take take your time um don't force yourself just because other people are doing it or um you know, whatever, anything like this, like don't, don't force it, let it be organic, let it be natural. And when you're ready, you'll know, you'll know the steps you want to take, you know, the queen of ones, you know, which action you'll need to take. And I think, you know, take your time. Sometimes when we try to control things, they don't always turn out how we want. And I would know all about that. <laughs> you know, you try to control situations, people, and then sometimes, you know, it comes back, bites you in the bum, blows up in your face. So Take it easy, what a science. Roll with the punches, um, and I'm going to leave it there for you this week. So I do hope that has been helpful. Don't forget to drop a like um, if you have enjoyed this reading. Um, and hopefully we shall be in touch very, very soon. So thanks, everyone, and bye for now.